Remember, 58 different buildings were washed into Barnegat Bay in Manilow and Malone. Think about that. Entire buildings, 58 of them, are sitting either bobbing in Barnegat Bay or sunken to the bottom of Barnegat Bay that we just started this week removing from the bay. 58 different buildings, just in Manilow and Malone. And we have about 50 to 60 pounds that had significant debris. Uh, we've got a third of them that are completely cleaned up now. No, not quite 90 days from the storm, all the debris gone. About 3 million cubic yards of debris already been removed from New Jersey. <laughs> and so we're, we're moving to get it to look more normal that way. And now we want to make our waterways navigable again. So I told you about the 58 buildings in Manilow. Across the Jersey Shore, 1,400 boats were sunken or abandoned in our waterways during the storm. What thing I tried to explain to folks in Washington was just how tough the people are around here. First, I tried to do it to kind of put their minds at ease and say, listen, we're going to be fine. The president came the first time. I said to him, you know, so how is everybody? So listen, people are shook up, Mr. President, and they've been shook over the loss of so much of their lives and their memories. But these are really tough people, and they're going to come back, and they're going to be okay. Then, about 60 days later, I was thrown how tough you were to try to scare the hell out of me. <laughs> these people, remember these people that said we're tough enough to survive this storm and be okay? These are the same people who are not very happy right now when you guys dawdling down here and not getting your work done, and you don't want to encounter these folks. <laughs> I am one of them, but only one. Imagine if I get a whole bunch of them down here. These not going to be good. Kept reminding me of where I came from and what we're all about. And so uh, it's been gratifying for me to be able to work for you. It's a great job. I will urge people who are in modest communities like UJ and West, don't give up yet. I can't promise you that we're going to be able to fix it and restore it the way it was. I don't know. But we're trying as hard as we can to give you the opportunity. I'm going to go to the young lady waving the American flag. All right. All right. advocating for you, um, doesn't sound right to me, and I don't want you um, to have to be worried about this another day longer than you do. We'll fight for you individually the way we're fighting for the whole state collectively, and let's see if we can do a little bit better than what you're doing right now, okay? Thank you.